This essay example, as well as thousands of others, is available in text format on our website for free and without registration. Simply Google Ivy Panda Free Essays. The writer of the Declaration of Independence has used various stylistic devices to bring out different messages in the text. These stylistic tools help shape the reader's perception to agree with the writer. The writer has used antithesis, linguistic patterns, rhythm, and the use of a poem writing structure as stylistic devices to convince the reader that there is a need to be united since all people are equal in the eyes of God. The use of rhythm in the Declaration of Independence intends to emphasize the points the author is making. Rhythm is created in the text by repeating phrases to bring out linguistic patterns. For example, the statement, we hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal, that their creator endows them, repeats a linguistic pattern. That all men are created and that they are endowed have the same linguistic pattern. The two parts have the same balance in terms of the usage of verbs, nouns, articles, and adjectives. The text also takes approximately the same length of time to pronounce out loud. All these characteristics form a rhythm throughout the text. The purpose of this rhythm in the text is to create a memorable pattern. This makes it much easier for the reader to remember the Declaration of Independence. Another stylistic aspect that has been used to change the reader's perception of the Declaration of Independence is the use of antithesis. This stylistic device has been used on various occasions throughout the text. Antithesis is the comparison of two contrasting ideas in the same sentence. For example, the sentence, it becomes necessary for people to dissolve the political bonds which have connected them with another and to assume among the powers of the earth the separate and equal station to which the laws of nature and of nature's God entitle them, uses antithesis. This statement hints that people are supposed to be united, yet it has become indispensable for them to stand alone. The statement also shows the contrast that even though men feel independent by cutting the political ties that bring them together, they serve one God who has entitled all of them to live together. This is a unifying factor among the audience of the Declaration of Independence text. This is relevant in the text as it shows the reader that people are not different from one another and that together they can achieve great things. The writer has written the Declaration of Independence like a poem. This writing structure can be based on the fact that the writer wants the reader to believe in the recital. The author wants the reader to also recite the declaration such that they are not only declaring the independence of the country, but they are also declaring their independence. The poem structure, therefore, makes the declaration easier to relate to. In conclusion, the use of rhythm, antithesis, linguistic patterns, and poetry has helped the writer show inequality in the country. The writer employed these specific stylistic devices to help shape the perception of the reader, thereby delivering the intended message successfully. The devices have helped the author of the Declaration of Independence not only pass on a message, but also ensure that the message is received without alteration. If you want to find more works like this essay on stylistic devices used in the Declaration of Independence, head over to ivypanda.com. It has a collection of samples with thousands of submissions covering virtually all academic subjects.